So the answer that the Quran gives is not that the Torah was corrupted so we sent the Injil and the Injil was corrupted so we sent the Quran. No! The Quran's answer to his question is that to the Jews he gave the Torah, to the Christians he gave the Injil and to the Muslims he gave the Quran so that they could compete with one another in good works towards Allah. He set up a race according to the Quran. That isn't the same as saying that the previous revelations were corrupt. Now argue with your own Quran. Yeah, let me the jump Quran in. lists who those people of faith are. It says it in Surah 22, 17, those who believe in the Quran, those who follow the Jewish scripture, and the Sabians, Christians, magicians which, and polytheists, which, which, Allah which, will which, judge between them on the day of judgment. This, and this number 17? Yeah. Yeah, this is this is no, 17. No, no, that's it. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're just you're just saying the people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He is not saying the people of the of the books. No, he's not it, talking it's, about. I get I get to show you. There's another passage. The the there is another passage, my friend. Bear with us. Four one six. You you bring me you bring me this one. You you just justify for this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this one, don't talk. If you're not if you're not books. if you're not accepting it, I'll, I'll show you another one. Yeah. Do you know the Do you know the passage in the do you, Brother? He's running. He's running away from our conversation by talking to you. No, brother. Your Do you know your Quran? I know my Quran. Right. Do you know the bit in the Quran where it says we could have made you one ummah, but we decided to make you into different ummahs so that you could compete in good works? Do you know where that passage is? I know where it's passage. Where Where is that passage? Do you know the one we're talking about? There is one talk about we just made you a lot of ummah so you can know each other. Yes, go on. Which which passage is that? Let's talk about that one. Here we go. I found it. So it's in Surah 5, Ayah 48, right? To thee we sent the scripture in truth, confirming the scripture that came before it and guarding it in safety. So judge between them by what Allah hath revealed. Which one? And follow not their vain desires diverging from the truth. Which I am. Yeah, this is Surah 5, Ayah Surah 5, 48. From the truth and hath come to thee. To each among you have we prescribed a law and an open way. If Allah had so willed, we would have made you a single people. But his plan is to test you that what he hath given to you to strive as in a race in all virtue, the goal of you all is to Allah, is to he that will show you the truth of the matters in your dispute. Okay. Basically, as he's speaking about, we yep. can make you one ummah, isn't it? Yes. So one ummah, it may depend on one ummah in religion, yes. one yes. In ummah in, real, yes. uh, in race, yes. one ummah in, in place, yes. one ummah in country. Yes. That's the difference. He's right. About it. But one second. Here Muhammad is saying, right? Muhammad is not saying. Allah is saying, or Allah is, Muhammad is putting into Allah's mouth the words, let the people of the gospel judge by what Allah hath revealed therein. Yeah. Right. So that's a seventh century statement, isn't it? Yeah. To a seventh century Christian community, isn't it? Yes. Exactly. Which means that that seventh century Christian community must have had the gospel in the seventh century, correct? They have. The, they have some of it, and some of it. They Where just does it say it. some of it? I just show you. No, you didn't. I just. You showed I, me a I verse. You, that's, that's, you didn't that's, show me that's, that. That's, I show you, and that's, uh, that's uh, seventy-five from Surah number two. Which, which, which said what? Seventy-five. Which from, said what? From Surah number two. It said perverted. They they write with this. With, no, with it says a hand. book. Yeah. But it didn't say the Injil. Which book are we talking so about? So now, now you accept that there is this in this in this ayah, Prophet, uh, Prophet Muhammad was speaking to the Inj uh, Christian in that time. But because it's clear. Uh, it says the gospel. Who are the people of the gospel? Oh, the Christian. Exactly. The, you are accepting that, but you are not accepting it in the other context. Right. That so it, is, it speaks about the people of the book. Well, show me then. Show me where it's saying that people of the book the, i.e. the Christians, because that's what we're talking about. They say, talking basically about the people of the book. Show me. And in the prophet time, show me. there was uh, Christian and Jews. Right, you've made a claim. You've made was, a claim. Was, yeah. You've made a claim that the Quran is teaching that the Bible has been changed. Okay? Surah 275 accuses us of perverting the book knowingly. Right? That I accept. That's what the Quran 
accuses Christians of doing. I reject that accusation. I think the Quran is wrong. And then you went to 79 and it says, woe to those who write the book in their own hands, then say this is from Allah. But which book are, is the Quran talking about? It's in it the doesn't, same where, where, context. It's where the does same it say, context. It's where does it say Injil? It's telling the whole story. This is what's speaking about the people who's for the book in the time of Muhammad, who was living in the Arabic, um, in the Arabic land at that time. Yeah. They were Jewish and they were uh, Christian living in the in the Arabic uh, land at that time. They they, they, they were. were. That's basically they were. the word they were for for them. Yes. Because Prophet, after he moved from Mecca, he was speaking with the people. I was not. And even... when Allah is speaking to those people, he says, "Let the people of the gospel judge by what Allah hath revealed." Because so, in other words, he's saying that you have the gospel with you i told you it's following the context if you come back just for, yeah, for this one yeah, for, the for, law, the, for, for the for the yeah for we the, can read it in context yeah. so we'll read it from verse 46 yeah. and in their footsteps we sent jesus the son of mary confirming the law that had come to before him so in the first century jesus confirms the torah as being reliable in the first century so the quran is saying in the first century the torah is reliable that had come before him, we sent the gospel, therein was guidance and light, confirming the Torah that had come before it, a guidance and an admission to those who fear Allah. So it's saying that Jesus then receives a gospel in the first century. Then Allah says in the seventh century, through Muhammad, to the Christians in Saudi Arabia, let the people of the gospel judge by what Allah hath revealed therein. In does it make yes. sense? Does it make sense to tell people to judge by a book that's corrupted? This is my Quran. I'll hold it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll hold it. Yeah. Answer that question. Yeah. I'm telling you exactly. No, so my is, question. What's my question? Where, where is the first you century? Are, you you want it to see like. So my, my when question is, is. My question is. My question is. What's your name? Rahim. Rahim. Bob. Nice to meet you. Rahim. My question is. Does it make sense to tell people? to follow a corrupted book yeah no 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 exactly right not. But does allah quran, does allah quran, command quran, people to follow quran, a book no the quran is saying the quran is saying the quran is saying exactly i'm telling you the quran is saying there is there is an angel and there is a torah this book are are revealed but it has been changed through the people who are who are who are who are, who are um, yes from the from the afterlife Jesus and those yeah. people who's go, who's come after him. Sorry, my English is. No, you're doing bit. fine. But who th those people who ch who changed the this this books? Right. Exactly where I pointed before. So they do doing that. So they just gain money and just really right. what they so, hand so, so let me reply to that. Uh, wait. Go on. But the Quran that's that's a point that is Quran confirming that there is a Jesus. Uh, there is a yeah. an, an Bible. Yeah. But it have been changing. Right. So hold on one second. You have agreed with me that yeah. it makes no sense for Allah to command people to follow a corrupted book. Yeah. But so here, exactly, exactly. Uh, here, no, one no, second, no, one second. No, 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 let me finish. finish let me finish. Only. Let the people of the gospel judge by what Allah hath revealed. That command yes. presumes that the book is there to follow in the first place. Now, we listen to now yes, wait exactly, one second, exactly. wait one second. Let's put this all together. Let's put this all together. Because you have rightly pointed out that the Quran accuses the people of the book of writing a book and saying that it's from Allah. It clearly must be another book because the Quran is saying that they have a gospel to follow, but those naughty Christians they write another book and say that that's from God. Your interpretation yes, yes, is perverting exactly, exactly. the Quran. No, 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 You're perverting the words you, of Allah. You bring this ayah, right? You're perverting you the words ayah, of Allah. Yeah. Right? yeah. That's, that's the people who's following the guys. Yeah. Let's follow it. What what does it say? It says, yes. let the people of the, the gospel, gospel yes. judge by what Allah hath revealed therein. If any do yes. fail, wait, 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 no, 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 wait, listen. Exactly, exactly. That's the point if I'm any about. do wait. fail to judge by what Allah hath revealed, they are those who exactly. rebel. Why, why Allah said, follow the gospel, what Allah has revealed inside right. of it. I'll tell because, you. No, let, I'll tell let, you. Me, let me finish. Okay. Because if there is... Some, the, the, that's why he, there is something else besides what Allah revealed in Injil. They are following another thing. They write themselves in the Injil. That's why Allah says, follow the, the Injil what has Allah revealed in it. 
So let not me, what you write by your hand. Let me let, let me let me just the original that. angel, not let, just what you let, write. Let, let, exactly let, let, let me reply. Saying, yeah, because because you. what you're saying, not yet, not you're, what you're saying does not work with this text. It's what this it's text right. is actually saying yeah. is that there is a people of the gospel. They have a gospel to follow, and they should follow it. No, and no, when they no, don't no. follow it, no. they are what, those that what rebel. Allah has revealed in it. Yes, no. What Allah hath revealed, yes. they are those who rebel. It does not say, and you have not shown, that that book has been changed. Exactly. If All I you want, have shown I, is that the Quran accuses the Christians and the Jews oh. of writing another book Bob, Bob, and saying bring, that that other book you, is from Allah. You bring this. Uh, and actually, bring, no, no, it's you the bring, Talmud that, that it's that. talking about. You bring, you bring, you bring this this verse, right? You bring yes. the God to judge on it. Yeah. You said. The, the Allah said to, to those um, Where does the it Christian, say? Where? Said, no, Go on. just bring that to, to, the, to the people of the gospel. Let's judge, uh, let's follow what Allah has revealed in the gospel. Right? Yeah. So, if they have the original gospel and there is no mistake on it, it's going to be basically follow the uh, follow the gospel that you have. That's what it says. Why, why the verse that says... That is exactly what follow, it says. No, it says what Allah has revealed in the gospel. Right. Because the, there is something no, else in the gospel. No, no, it says the let the people of the gospel yes, judge but, by but what Allah what has Allah revealed, revealed therein. One second. That means there no, is something else no, in No, no, it doesn't that mean that at all. Exactly. That is you say. inserting into the text something no, that is not there. No, you speak. That is not That's, there. You said that, right? Listen, you said that, listen, right? listen. Reveal, judge. Listen. Judge. Does the, judge. Quran, does the Quran say that anyone can change the word of Allah? Yeah, just run away. Just run away to the other topic. No, no, right? no. That's, it's the that's same messing. topic. That's a, no, no, no. We was. Is the what? Injil the word of Allah? Bro, let's say. Is the Injil the, the word of Allah? Let's, let's just speak what, what you Yes, have. let's just talk you about you this topic. About so you You're running away from the topic. Do you remember what the original topic was? The first thing you told me when I came here, not you told me, you are speaking about what you pe Muslim people believe something that's what not What was the original the topic? No. You yeah. don't know, do you? You we, don't we, even know. No, no, no. I know. The I know original topic was that the Quran states that Muhammad can be found in the Injil. That's what the Quran I states. Didn't, I didn't. That's a separate topic. That with you. That when was I the come, topic. The first thing. That was the topic. The first thing. Yeah. The first thing. I so we were speaking Look. about. You told about Muslims believe. Yes. And in, 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 yes. in, in things that's not in Quran. Yes. I told you Muslims believe everything yes. in Quran. Listen. And you told me that that uh, show me where is in Quran. It says that the Injil have. Been, Let, let's stick have to this passage because you get upset. I show you. I show you. The Quran I states. You, the, Quran, the, says, the Quran states. The Quran. No, you haven't. You have not shown me that. I show you two. No, you haven't. You haven't shown me one. You haven't shown me one. You showed me one verse that accused Christians of perverting the book. Sorry, per perverting the words of Allah, but not saying how. Then you showed me another verse you that you accused the Jews of Christians of writing a book. And then we see a verse that tells Jews, Chris, Jews and Christians to follow the scriptures that they have. Let's read it in context. The, the, Let's read it in original, context. The original. The, Let's read it in context. The, the, the gospel that Shall Allah we do this time? Shall we do this time? Would you like to do this time so we're not interrupting one another constantly? Yeah. Would you prefer yeah. to do it timed? That's one of the yeah. better, yeah. Could, could you, would you be willing to time it? Get your stopwatch out on your phone. How many minutes? Three minutes, three minutes. Uh, no, I have that long time with you because I'm just... Well, you, when you need to go, you need going. to go. When you need to go, you need to go. It's yeah. totally fine. Okay? Right, I'm, I'll go for my, my, my three minutes first. Tell me when you're ready. And, and if you could let us see the clock so that there's no yeah. dispute, yeah? Three minutes or two? Three minutes. Right? Let us both see the clock. Now, let's read it in context. And to thee we sent the scripture in truth, confirming the scripture that came before it and guarding it in safety. So judge between them by what Allah hath revealed. So it's affirming that the gospel is a source of authority. And to follow not their vain desires diverging from the truth that come to thee, to each among you have we prescribed a law. So the Jews have got theirs, the Christians have got theirs, and the Muslims have got theirs, and an open way. If Allah had so willed, he would have made you a single ummah. 
but his plan is to test you in what he hath given to you, so strive as in a race, in all virtue. So it's saying Allah has revealed three sets of scriptures, one to Christians, one to Jews, one to Muslims. If he had wanted to, you should have all followed the Quran and been one Ummah. But that wasn't what he wanted you to do. He wants the Jews to follow the Torah, the Christians to follow the Gospel, the Muslims to follow the Quran, and for you all to compete in following what Allah has revealed to you. That instruction only makes sense, only makes sense if the Torah is really there, if the Gospel is really there, and if you can actually follow it. If you can't follow it because it's been corrupted, then Allah is literally giving you a command that you can't fulfill and he's talking gibberish to you. He's commanding you to do gibberish. Is that what you're saying about your God? Are you saying that Allah is doing gibberish? He's not even listening, so I'll just talk because to you guys. To talk to Allah, now, ladies and teaching. gentlemen, he's interrupting. Give me any he's interrupting. He's interrupting. Me so when I interrupt him, but watch, he'll complain. Now, the reality is, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen we know, me, we know, we know what the Torah and the Injil are from the 7th century. He's going to run away soon. He's going to run away soon. And because this guy wants him to run away, a man who will run away when I debate him. Bob, right? You are preaching. So, ladies and gentlemen, you are preaching. You are not now he's notice he's interrupting, you're... but when I interrupt him, he'll complain. We know what the Torah and the Injil look like in the 7th century. You can go to museums and see what it looks like from the 7th century. And do you know what it looks like, ladies and gentlemen? It looks like the Bible I have in my bag. And that means that the charge that Muslims are making against the Christians that our Injil has been changed and lost is a lie. It contradicts their Quran and it contradicts the manuscript evidence as well. Three minutes for you. Don't complain when I interrupt. Well, you have three minutes now. You just win. I mean, we just start. You just said, start, you start with ladies and gentlemen. We are debating here. We just ask me a question and I just answer it to you. I am not like a professional in, 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 the, in Lahut or in religions or anything. I am a simple man. I'm asking you a question. You are answering me a question. That's simple. If you start preaching and say, ladies and gentlemen, I will not understand what question do you have. So what you, do you want to me in three minutes to answer you right now, Bob? I'm asking you. So I want you to answer this question. Why is Allah commanding the Jews and the Christians to follow a book that you say is not there to follow? I didn't say there is no angel. I didn't say there is no Bible. I didn't say there is nothing. I'm saying there is an angel and this book are true, are from God. But the people who is following it in that time, they add in it and they change in it. You're and contradicting yourself. You're literally contradicting yourself. I'm telling you the book, there is a word of Allah and there is in, 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 the, in that book. But but there is another thing they've been added from the people after the Jesus, like the Christian, like the Jews, who, are, who came after, after, after uh, Jesus, they, they add Does it make sense it. to follow a corrupted book? No. So why is Allah commanding Jews and Christians to follow a corrupted book? As I show you, it's saying, let, uh, let those people follow what Allah have revealed in this book. Listen to not your answer what, side not, to not, side. Not, 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 not to follow, that's why have they been written with him hand. Listen to your that answer side to side. What have Allah revealed in it? Because if there is one only gospel, Allah would say this. Okay, let's, uh, let the people of the gospel follow the gospel. Allah said, let the people of gospel follow what Allah have revealed on it. Listen to your answers side to side. Listen to what you said. You said it makes no sense for Allah to tell people to follow a corrupted book. And then in the next breath you're saying it makes sense for Allah to tell people to follow a corrupted book. No. Because you can't... No, this is your time. I'm just interrupting you like you interrupted me. And that's exactly the simple simple answer. If you open your mind, you don't understand it. You're saying that's the, the, the 70, the 70, 72 versions of, uh, sorry, of our angel on this stuff. And let everyone follow it. We don't have 72 virgins. 
Is that the main topic? You, it's, you, about, you, it's about you the, don't like being interrupted. It's about the Shall no. we not interrupt one another? No, 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 no. I'm not. I'm not. I'm, uh, that's what I'm to want to be. You are just asking and answer and answer and asking. I'm not about the mood of preaching. You are just ladies and just me tell me. No, it's not about that. I am a simple. I'm not a professional in the religions or in this stuff. But I'm asking you that what I know in a simple question. Yeah. The Bible. You. Your time. This is your time. Right, shall we try this now without you interrupting me and then I won't interrupt you? No, I, no, yeah? I will not start along with you because you're going to start... Three uh, minutes, three you, minutes. You're going to start preaching. Three minutes. I'll talk to you, but try listen, listening. I've got, listen, right? Leave, leave why, why, why are you afraid? Leave, leave the time and let's talk about asking me and okay. asking Lola so, what so, I am not. So here's the problem with your argument. The argument that you made to me. If these are the statements you made. Statement number one. The, bar, the Torah and the Injil has been corrupted. Statement number two. It makes no sense for Allah to command you to follow a corrupted book. Statement number three. Allah commands you to follow the Torah and the Injil that are corrupted. Those are contradictory statements and they have all come from your mouth. And the reason why they have come from your mouth is because you are ignoring what your Quran says. Your Quran does accuse Christians of perverting the book with their tongues. It does accuse Christians of writing, the, the Jews, of writing another book and saying that it's from Allah. And it does command that Jews and Christians should follow the Torah and the Injil. Now those three statements of the Quran, I'm trying to help the Quran. You're the one chucking it into a cesspit of contradiction. I'm helping the Quran from you. The, the only way those three statements can make sense is this. One, the Injil and the Torah are not corrupted and they are there in the seventh century. Two, Jews and Christians are distorting the words of those books by their own words. And three, they have written other books and called them as being from God. But if those, if my three statements are correct, then that means the Injil and the Torah are there in the seventh century. I don't, I don't agree what you are saying. Let, let, let. I'm just telling you this, or there is no contribution if you understand what I am saying about yeah. that. I am telling you, Allah said, let the people of gospel follow what Allah has revealed in it. Yeah, that's the first one. The second one I show you, it says um, the hellfire will be for the people who is writing the Bible or writing the book with their hand and saying that's from Allah. It's a conditional offer. Yeah. So, so I'm telling you, that's Allah saying this. That's, uh, that's, that's a statement says that the angel is correct and we believe it. But you don't. We, we, listen. <laughs> you Muslims, contradict yourself. No. We are... We are not Muslims until we believe that there is there is there is an uh, Injil and there is a uh, where, where, where is the Injil now? It has been corrupted. How do you know it that? Been corrupted. How been, that? Because that's our religion says. And the Quran that's says not it's, what the Quran says. It's, it's, it is the Quran says. It's in the whole context. If the context was, if the Surah was speaking about the people who is like, uh, who is uh, with people, uh, with books, like Christian yeah. and Jewish. And after that, he complete, 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 complete. Yeah. That's in cost. Uh, that, that's mean the context. It's following each other. No, it doesn't. And the context says exactly the opposite of what you're saying. Because Surah 48 says, to thee we sent the scripture. So that's to Muhammad and he's talking about the Quran. In truth, confirming the scripture that came before it and guarding it in safety. So judge between them by what Allah hath this revealed. Is the so if you, if you look, if listen, you look at the context. Listen, listen. listen. The next verse is the accusation that the Quran actually if makes. If you want to look to the context, look to the, the no. ayah before it. Look, look. And follow not their wanna... vain desires, diverging from the truth that hath come to thee. Well, so in other words, you want... the Quran's if... accusing the Jews and the Christians of not following the Injil and the Torah. Yes. It's not accusing the Torah of the Injil of being changed. Well, if you want to look to the context, you don't look to the next verse. 
You, you want to go back? Before. Yes. Look so, to that six, uh, 46. Yeah, let's go to 46. Them, yeah, let's read from 46. Yeah, it's, it says, And in their footsteps we sent Jesus, the son of Mary, confirming yes. the law that had come before him. Yes. Which, uh, would you agree? Wait one second, I've got a question. So the, context, uh, the context says, it says that uh, uh, Jesus had been sent with the Bible. And with the, the Bible, angel. With the angel. And he's confirming the Torah. The Torah. Do you agree? Wait one second, I've got a question on that point. Do you agree that when it says that Jesus was confirming the Torah, that the Torah was valid at the time of Jesus? If, 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 if the book was not corrected and not, there is no, no wrong anything uh, in it, why should Allah bring another book? That's a That's great a, that, question. This, this, this is the book, this is the book, like angel came yeah. because the Torah was corrupted. Can I answer that question? Let, you know, you've answered the point. Let okay, complete the point, point and then I'll answer let your question. Point. And after that, Quran came after the after the corruption of the angel. The angel was corrupted and was writing by hand. That's why the context is talking about this. Um, so it's confirming the box before. So let me let me let me address that point. Confirming the book before, and after that, it says in the same Quran, it says oh, uh, that those people who's writing the books in his hand. Uh, and, and, and they're buying something for it. Yeah. That was the clear point that before in telling that there was corrupted, so that's why the another uh, the, the another elevation comes. So let me address that point. Came. Let me address that point. He asked the question, does it make sense for Allah to send another book unless the previous book has been corrupted? Well, Surah 48 answers that very question for him. So I'm not going to answer him. His own Quran is going to answer his question. And what oh, does the Quran oh, answer I the question? The no, I listen to mind. you. Okay. Let okay. me speak. Okay. Here's what the Quran says in answer to his question. It says, we prescribed a law and an open way. If Allah had so willed, he would have made you a single people. But his plan is to test you in what he hath given you to strive as in a race in yes. all virtues. Yes. So it's in other words, no, let me finish my point. Let me finish my point. So the answer that the Quran gives is not that the Torah was corrupted, so we sent the Injil. And the Injil was corrupted, so we sent the Quran. No, the Quran's answer to his question is that to the Jews he gave the Torah, to the Christians he gave the Injil, and to the Muslims he gave the Quran so that they could compete with one another in good works towards Allah. He set up a race according to the Quran. That isn't the Whoa. same as saying that the previous revelations were corrupt. Now argue with your own Quran. No, I'm not going to argue. This, this can say Ummah. You, you say the word Ummah in the, umma. In the Quran. It says Ummah. Umma. Yeah. It's not saying one, uh, it's, not, it's not saying we made you a lot of religions. He said, what, what, if we want, we're going to make you one Ummah. One Ummah, it's, it's, it's mean that it may be one Ummah on, on basically on races, on, 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 the, on the type of race. But the context uh, here no, is no, revelation. No, 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 it's not. And it's it not, is. It's, not, it's talking about that. But it's, it's the saying, context it's is saying, revelation. It's saying Ummah. Yes. Ummah, that means he could make you one people. Based, it could, it on, could mean. based on revelation. Wait, it's what it's the context. Wait, You're ignoring say, the context. It, it said maybe they're going to be one Ummah based on the, the land you're living in, maybe based on the religion, maybe based on the. What is that? Race. No. Ethnicity. Yes. Nationality. Yes. Language. And exactly the same. Exactly the same ayah in another surah. It says, we, we made you, we could made you one ummah, but we made you difficult so you know each other. So it's not speaking about the other. No, it doesn't other, say that. It doesn't say that. You're, you're, you're perverting the words of Allah. He's literally doing what the Quran accuses Christians and Jews are doing. He's perverting his own book by his words. Because the context of the verse, the context of the verse is, listen to the context. It, all the way through 48, it's talking about revelations. It's saying, to thee we sent the scripture in truth, confirming the scripture that came before you. We prescribed a law and an open way. So the context of what the Ummah is based on is the revelation. And Allah is saying, 
We have not made you one ummah based on revelation. We've made you multiple ummahs based on multiple revelations so that you can compete in good works. So you're the one perverting the words of Allah. No, no, I'm not you are, perverting. You are. I am, I am explaining Surah 2, 85 no, applies am, to you. I am explaining to you meaning that ummah could have the meaning. But that's not what it's saying in 78. What does he mean in 78? I've told you, this is the same, the same verse you bring it. Yes. That is saying so about what is the Ummah based on in 78? It could, they tell you, it could mean a lot no, of... No, not could be. Learning. It could no. be. It's very clear it's about the revelation. He would have made you a single Ummah, but to test you in what he hath given you. What did he give to them? What did he give to them? Answer the question. What did he give to them? What he didn't give. What did he give? He give he give a lot. Oh of dear. We are talking about what is coming from. You Allah. talk about You're context. About, You're ignoring good. the context saying, of the verse. He's saying good Go in on. the finish of it. In the finish of it. Yes, yes, down here. The, yeah. The goal of the you of is all to Allah. Allah. Is well, it is no, he. No, no, yeah. He he, he has given you. He, he hath to given you, you yes. to so strive in as in a race in all virtues. Yes. Right. How do we know what those virtues are? Exactly. That's what I'm telling you about. It's, maybe it's going to be based on a lot of meanings. I am not telling you. I'm telling you when, you are, when, when I arrived here, I am not provisional of the religion and the difference of between these things. But I am answering you in a simple question that I know. But I mean, you've ignored the context of your own passage. I don't know. I told you. Literally, it says here, look, to thee we were, we sent the scripture in truth confirming the scripture that came before yeah, it. It's, it's came to here. thee, to each among you, yeah. have we prescribed a law. Now, who is... Who at first, let's just look at these words, right? Yeah. Who is the each among you? Who's that talking about? In the context. In the context, it's saying. To each among you. Rule Who's between, the among you? Rule, rule, rule between them. Who rule is the each among them. you? Answer that question. He said, he said wait, wait. He said once, uh, and we will send you the secretion truth. So you can rule between them. Who are the not people? answering was between, my question. Who was the people was between prophet? No, answer a question with a question. <laughs> My question to you is, who is the each among you in that word there? Okay. The, well, there were the uh, we Christian and, and the Jews between the Muslims in that time. There we go. Medina. Christians, Jews and Muslims. Brilliant. Have we prescribed a law? Who, what's, what, what, what is the law that it's referring to here? It, it may could be being the, 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 the role in the Sharia that is being in the angel. Does it say, does it say Sharia here or does it say Torah? What does it say? No, 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 the rule. It's, 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 a rule. It's, it's a rule. So each, so each of them have a rule. Yeah, that's why. That's why he, he said in the uh, in the verse before it. Great. Let's judge. So now, the now, go to the next. It's it's now it, it Bob, says, Bob, it and we could, it. we would have made you a single it's, ummah. So what is the ummah based on? What? Religion. Thank you very much. He understands but the passage better than you do. Yeah, I told you I'm not an expert. I've been laboring it to you, you for five I minutes, no, no, no. bro. I, I told you. It's, I know Arabic. Yeah. Continue so, that sort of. Right. Except. Yes. We, he were, yes. But his plan is to test you in what he hath given you. So strive as in a race. Now answer me this question. Is there more than one party or just one party in a race? Multiple parties. Multiple parties. Are the parties here the ummas? Different religions. Different religions. So we've got different religions with different revelations yes. that should compete in a race. Agreed? No. Not compete. Allah wants. He said if Allah wants. If Allah wants. Yes. Yes. Can do. Yes. But except those. Yes. In continue. Except here. Yes. Go on. But, go to but. Hey, but. But. Yes. See, but. Go on. But, but his plan. No, you see, you're not listening. The, no, you see, you're the one who's maligned the context. Let's read it all again. Let's read it all again. Let's read it all again. He would have made a single people. So what is the conditional? Okay, but. What is the conditional to the but? The conditional to the but, my friend, is that he could have made you one people 
But there you go. So he could have made you one people. But did you get that? He could have made you one people. But so that's the conditional. But what does he go on to say? But his plan is to test you in what he has given you yes. so strive as in a race this is the answer and in a race is there more than one party or just one party different parties, different parties. and in the context of this passage who are the different parties Jews, Christian, Muslims. thank you very much Jews Christians Muslims yes, exactly. so Jews Christians Muslims all have a different revelation that they're supposed to live by. That's why he Correct. said. That's why. Cor that's you why, disagree. That's why, that's why he said, in the context, let them believe and follow Protest. what Allah have revealed. Yes. In the, in the angel. And does it make sense to command them to follow a book that can't be followed because it's corrupted? It's saying that this book has Answer something the question. from Allah, and the other thing and is being corrupted. So does it make sense? to tell people to follow a book that's been corrupted. Answer the question. Exactly the same. Follow what Allah have revealed. I'm going to give you Not one more you chance. Does it what make sense writing? to follow a book that's been corrupted? What do you think? It's not. It's not. It's not. It's what not do you true. think? It's, as well. it's, it's not. What do you think? The New Testament's corrupted. Right. right. So, so. Yeah, so basically, <laughs> they've trial, just said, so, far, it's a trial, so what trial, they've uh, just said, one, two, okay, three, right. have all right. just right. said, yeah. Allah's commands right. make no sense. Oh, yeah, That's, That's right. exactly right. why, why? Right. Because right. Allah commands them to, right. commands me to do something that they Bro, say I can't friend, do. You are preaching. My friend, you are preaching. That's what, that's not, you're just preaching, you're not preaching like for one. It's better than Tasfiyah, better than your, better than your Tasfiyah. Better than your Tasfiyah.